Turn to breaking medical news right now. As many of you may be preparing your breakfast this morning, there is a developing and potentially lethal headline to tell you about regarding a breakfast staple. Dozens of people are sick in five states after eating frozen berries and pomegranate mix contaminated with hepatitis A. We want to welcome ABC Susan Salney making her GMA weekend debut. She's in Washington with more on this story. Good morning, Susan, and welcome. Good morning. Glad to be here. Well, ever grab for a bag of frozen berries in the morning to make a smoothie for breakfast? Or to make muffins or a cake? Plenty of people do. Well, you might want to pay special attention to a new alert coming from federal health officials. Some of those berries are making people very sick. Fitting organic berries into your diet is supposed to be one of the most healthful things to do. But that truism is being tested now. The Food and Drug Administration has linked an outbreak of hepatitis A to a frozen organic berry mix processed at an Oregon farm and sold nationally at Costco. This morning, officials say thousands of bags of tainted berries may be sitting in freezers across America. Yeah. Oh my God. That's shocking. Yeah, it's really not good. But it is a bit concerning. It makes you wonder. So far, at least 30 people have been sickened in five western states, Arizona, California, Colorado, New Mexico, and Nevada. Health officials have not announced a recall, but they recommend avoiding Townsend Farms organic antioxidant blend. Costco has pulled the product and is trying to notify customers who might have bought it, but it's unclear how many people that may be. We just used it a couple weeks ago at a big family breakfast. We put it in some muffins, so it's a little bit concerning. We hope we don't all have hepatitis. <laughs> hepatitis A is a highly contagious liver infection. Symptoms can include fatigue, fever, and joint pain. It can be deadly, yes, but not for everybody. Once the virus has infected you, it's impossible to treat and get rid of uh, on a quick basis. It goes away over time. Well, hepatitis A often finds its way into the food supply through infected food handlers who don't take proper precautions, such as washing their hands. Federal officials are trying to find the source of the contamination, but the berry mix contained produce from farms here in the U.S., Argentina, Chile, and Turkey, so the search could take a while. Big, Young, scram big scramble this morning. Very scary. Susan, great to have you on the broadcast. Thank you very much. And once again, welcome to ABC News.